Hello and welcome to Trojan Talk. I'm your host, Aaron Taylor. Today we'll talk about ways that students and even alumni can take advantage of Troy University's Career Services and my guest today, Coordinator of Career Services, Lauren Cole. Lauren, mm -hmm. thanks for joining us here today. Thank so, you. And we're talking about, you know, ways that students, faculty, staff, the entire Troy University community can help career services mm -hmm. in guiding students down a career path. Yes. Tell us a little about, about how they can do that. Okay, well, one of the best ways is gonna be online because that's gonna serve any student on a Troy campus or an online student or across the world, really. Um, so we have a resource that we call Trojan Link, okay. and it's on our homepage, which is just troy.edu slash career services. And there's a link for students and alumni to log in. There's a faculty link and um, what they in an employer link. And so students and alumni, they just simply click on that. If they don't know their password, mm -hmm. then they can just click forgot password and it'll email them and let them reset it. But please use your Troy email address. Okay. But in that resource are any job postings or internships that employers call us with. We put them in Trojan link because that is our go-between. Instead of us keeping a long list of jobs and students, Students themselves can access Trojan Link for any job postings that we have. And 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 in that regard, having it in a I guess a web format, yes, uh, a lot of times that might benefit the alums, especially yes. the recent alums yes. that are away from campus and and can't stop by Eldridge to come and yes. see you. Right? Uh, do you see a lot of, of of those recent alums taking advantage of this? Site? We do. And another perk of Trojan Link is if they will go ahead and upload their resume. First of all, they can use it to apply for jobs through the system. Employers can see their resume, but even better, the first time they upload it, it comes to us for review. Okay. So students, alumni, anybody, um, well, not any, any Troy yeah. student or alumni can access the system, upload their resume, we will email them back with suggested changes or, you know, just some remarks about their resume. And that's one of those crucial elements because yes. the resume is probably one of the trickiest parts because that's you right. get a lot of different information coming from a lot of different sources. And a lot of it, and especially my experience with some of the students, is wrong. That's They're getting right. some wrong information that's about right. the resumes. So it helps them to be able to, to at least get that right first impression there. It so. does, and a lot of people just haven't been educated on how to do a correct mm -hmm. one, and it's the first cut, it's the first impression, and oftentimes with entry-level jobs, those are vital, that first impression. So we would love to look at any resumes that come in from alumni or students, So, but if they upload them in Trojan Link in their account, then they can use them to apply for jobs, and then, like I said, the first time they do it, it comes to us for review. All right, well, access to the website is mm -hmm. important, but uh, Obviously, there needs to be, and you want support mm -hmm. from the faculty yes, and staff. Very and much and so. how can faculty and staff take advantage of the career services and, and help the students? especially guiding them maybe on choices of their career path. Yeah, we're excited because faculty now have their own account in Trojan Link. We've imported in all full-time faculty and sent out an email to that regard, giving them instructions on how to do that, or they can contact us with questions. Mm -hmm. But they have an account in there where they can view all the job postings. Um, they can encourage employers to join in and post jobs okay. and internships. Um, they can contact us with more for more information on that. And then a really cool feature that we have now is um, virtual mock interviewing so we have a module in there and now we do mock interviews in person mm -hmm. on the Troy campus but for our satellite campuses and just for the volume um, that a class if a professor wants their whole class to do a mock interview they can access that in Trojan Link there's recorded interviews in there there's a general one that's probably the best to use mm -hmm. and um, they can just do their mock interview if they have a, um, a webcam or maybe even on their phone and then at the end of it they can put who they want it to be emailed to okay they can come to the career center for review or to that professor so or to their to, family just to, to an, uh, maybe i guess analyze their yes, response exactly. and, and how they would do in a mock interview yes exactly how they react mm -hmm. and they get two or three chances to answer the question so <laughs> they you know it's just good practice and a lot of faculty might be interested in incorporating that because i know a lot of faculty want that real life job preparation in their class and and Obviously, that that recruiting other groups and other employers and organizations to be yes. a part of it as well, because they may have connections exactly. in the field that that you all don't know about exactly. and have no, no idea. To yeah, connect with, and so. and we know every department is various along the lines of how much they provide job information or internship information, but 
we hope Trojan Link is just a clearinghouse for mm -hmm. all of that information. So students know they're looking for a job or internship, this is where we go. And faculty, we have a good start, but obviously won't have everyone in it, every employer. So faculty could be a great help in building that resource. Well, here's hoping that some of the, the faculty members here on campus can help build that resource mm -hmm. and help support career services. And, and of course, if any students uh, on campus want to see you in person and take advantage of it, sure. where can they find you? We're 104 Eldridge Hall, okay. and then on our website, it lists the contact information and locations for the other campuses as well. All right, so opportunity there on the website to get as much information to help them guide them on a path to a career through Troy mm -hmm. University. Yes. Thanks for joining us here today. Thank you. And thank you for joining us on today's edition of Trojan Talk.